In this video, I would like to show how bombs work in High Fleet. For this demonstration, I've managed to sneak up on an enemy strike group that has landed. I'm using a modified OWL ship with four bombs attached. So the first thing you want to do is to dive towards the target and get as close as you can. And then I'm going to hold middle mouse, which will show the trajectory of the bomb. The bombs are free falling, so the only way to change the trajectory of the bomb is to change the trajectory of your ship. So my goal right now is I'm going to try to do bombing run and drop all four bombs in the vicinity of this target. And I'll just have to survive long enough for the bombs to hit. So, this is the first problem if you're bombing targets. Even if it is a slow ship like the Bore, in many cases they will take off before your bombs even hit the target. Let's try this again. Okay, now have you seen um, the first impact over here was slightly off target and the damage was only 112. And on this target, we um, landed a better hit with the damage was 3600. Let's see if we can take a close up of the target before my ship is gone. I think what we can see is that the bottom piece of the target got blown out. Okay, so. <clears throat> Let, let's consider what happened right now. If, a, if the bomb hits close to the target but not on the target, it's almost useless. If it hits on the target, you still have the problem of <clears throat> if it hits armor, it will do minimal damage. So here's one more thing I would like to show you about how to attach bombs on your ship. Like as you can see here, this is a very unconventional setup. Um, if, it's, if you see here, I got two, four, six slots. I got about 10 bombs arranged in a six slot wide area and four slots high. If it would have just attached four at the bottom, it would be just <clears throat> three bombs. And this way it allows you to have a larger bomb shaft and carry more payload. However, there's a small problem with that, which is, uh, as you can guess, the, the bombs colliding with stuff when we're getting released. So let's try it. And as you can see, um, if you have high forward velocity, the bomb collides with the own ship and it's gone. So let's try this again. Try with the slower speed. So if bombs are this hard to use, what's, what's the point of using them at all then? In many cases, if you want to ambush uh, ships on the ground, you can just use a fast ship with good armor. You can hit most of them before they even take off. Or you can get planes, attack them, or missiles. So why use bombs at all? I think there's a very narrow application, especially in hard. So there's two ways, you can, two main types of, of ships that could employ bombs. Those that have bombs as a as secondary armament, like, like those guys over here, they have two bombs at the bottom. But there's an advantage and a disadvantage with that. The advantage is you have a bunch of extra bombs, so some extra power you can use if there's a target of opportunity, like a slow ship that's taking, slowly, taking off slowly and you can drop the bombs on it. The problem is you got bombs attached to your ship and if they get hit, you have a one-ton bomb exploding at the hull of your ship which I think can detonate the entire ship because it has no armor below it. And another disadvantage is you cannot, or you should not, 
I think it would be a bad idea to have a large array of bombs on a ship that's also exposed to normal combat. For the same reason, if, if the bomb rack gets hit, you have a huge explosion. So I, what I would do is specialize into a second ship type that is exclusively for delivering bombs and getting away fast. Something like this crocodile. Of course, the vertical bomb shaft is probably a bad idea. I would probably have to use a um, level bombing type of setup. Or a horizontal bomb, rather. So the purpose of that would be you get a ship with a pretty large fuel range, good speed, like something like that. <clears throat> and then the next problem is you need to find a target that's worthy of many bombs, of all the trouble. And it has to be a landed target, not a way of your position. Which would be, for example, um, the aircraft carrier groups. Again, you can pick out the aircraft carrier, drop the bomb where you want it. Or you can attack strike groups. Especially on hard, if you would be able to get a Nomad or a Vaya cruiser while they're on the ground, not doing anything, and just dropping four or five bombs on top of them and get out, getting out, that would be a good purpose. Oh, but then again, you still have the problem. You have this highly specialized target that has to be in a special um, position for you to attack. And until that window of opportunity arrives, you're just carrying a large ship around with extra bombs that uses fuel. So, is it worth using bombs in this game, especially in the hard campaign? Uh, I guess that's for you to decide in your own campaign. I actually don't have a good answer for it. So, this should conclude this guide, and I hope this was somewhat entertaining and educational. And as always, thanks for watching.